Okay, day four. Uh, still looking at rounding, but this, this lesson we're going to look again at rounding with decimal numbers. So just extending our knowledge. It's the same principle. If I'm going to round 2.65 to the nearest whole number or the nearest integer, I'm going to need to start by drawing a number line. And I'm going to think, what are the two whole numbers then, either side of 2.65? Well, here's my ones column. So I've got two. And then the next whole number is three. Halfway then is 2.5. Because I've got these two digits here, tenths and hundreds, I might just put that it's 2.50. So then 2.65, I can really clearly see, well, 2.5, 2.6, it's gonna be about here. So I can see it's closer to the number three. So 2.65 to the nearest whole or the nearest integer is three. So your turn, you've got 16.34. So think, what's the nearest whole number on either side. So here's my whole number. What's going to go here? What's going to go here? And then what will be in the middle? Pause the video, come back when you're done to check your answer. So here we go, we've got 16 is the um, smaller whole number, then 17 will be the next whole number, 16.5 is halfway. Again, because I've got these two digits, I might want to put five zero just to make it really um, clear what's going on. So 16.34, well, 16.1, 2, 3, it'd be about here. So I can see it's going to round down to the number 16. So 16.34 to the nearest whole number is 16. What about this one then? Well, 2.65 to the nearest one decimal place or the nearest tenth. Again, same procedure, I just need to work out what's the nearest tenth. So here's my tenths column here. So it's going to be 2.6 is the lower multiple. Then the higher multiple, I just add a tenth, be 2.7. Halfway then will be 2.65. So I can see, oh look, 2.65 is exactly halfway. We know if it's exactly halfway, it rounds up to the higher multiple. So 2.65. Round to the nearest tenth is 2.7. Your turn, again, think about your number line. Here's your tenths column. So what's the lower multiple going to be? What's the higher multiple going to be? What's the halfway point? Pause the video, have a go. Okay, here we go. So I can see I've got 16.3. So the next multiple will be 16.4. Halfway then will be 16.35. Well, 16.34 I can see is just before 16.35. So it's going to round down to 16.3. So 16.3, whoops, four. So the nearest tenth is 16.3. And again, I can see here's my tenths column. I've just got tenths, I don't have any hundreds anymore, just tenths. So stop this video and go and have a look at the independent task and see how you get on. Remember the answers are on the next page so you can self-mark once you've had a really good go at the questions yourself.